I'm just curious if you'd had any earlier conversation and he wanted you for the trial and you just weren't available or was this your first conversation? I, I can never comment on, on something like that. Um, but I, I will tell you, looking at this case, I certainly wish uh, I had come in sooner as opposed to later. And um, unfortunately, this is the way this is the way it is. But he's got me now and, and I'm certainly willing to give him everything I have. And, and hopefully we'll get the, the best result possible for him. Has Tory talked to you? Does he feel hopeful? Does he feel slighted by what happened? Can you give us the temperature on that? Sure, well, you know, as, as you may know, Tory has never been convicted of a crime and he has never had to deal with the circumstances that he's dealing with. So the adjustment that he's going through is, is one of, um, you know, it, it's new to him. So he's really, uh, to his credit, he's listening to his lawyers. Uh, he's an incredibly articulate young man. Uh, and in, in in all of that, he, he certainly, there are things that certainly in the trial he wished had gone the other way. So, so I guess to answer your question quickly and briefly, it would be yes. Um, but he's trying his best to adjust to everything. And in and, and light of the fact that he's never been in this situation before, it's, it's really a, a tough process to go through. Is there something that happened in this trial that you think would warrant an appellate court throwing out the conviction? Well, I haven't even made an appearance yet, so I, I don't think it's proper for me to comment on the evidence. But I will say this much. There's mistakes in trials all of the time. Right? It's a human system. It's going to uh, produce errors regardless. Now, when you have a high profile case, there's a lot more things to worry about. A lot more things for the judiciary to worry about, a lot more things for the defense lawyers to worry about, a lot more things for the prosecution to worry about. So all players are now playing with additional work and, and need to be protecting those safeguards to ensure that there's a fair trial to begin with. And I, I have to tell you, nine out of 10 times we get it wrong. So I would, I would, I would say that there's probably a significant chance that there are numerous errors that that are within the system and within this case that that are to be that should be explored and see if perhaps the the results would have been different should it gone the other way.